In 1922, a child is born in a small village in Punjab. There is no electricity. Books are rare. Schooling is basic, but the curiosity is strong. Years later, this child studies chemistry, not because it's glamorous, because it's possible and the only option. He earns scholarship and moves from Lahore to Delhi and to England for a PhD. Now the world of science is changing. Scientists know DNA carries information, but no one knows how it is read. In 1950s, he moves to North America and start working on an important question. Can we write DNA in the lab? By 1960s, he does something radical. He synthesizes artificial DNA in the lab. This scientist is Hargobind Khurana, born in a small village in India and wins Nobel Prize in 1968 for cracking the genetic code, for showing how DNA converts into protein. From a small village without power to decoding the language of life, science doesn't care from where you start. It only cares how far you are willing to go. Subscribe Genetic Education for more stories, research and insights.